Let's get started by signing into our MetaMask wallet. If you do not have a MetaMask installed on Google Chrome or Firefox, pause the video and do so now. X out of this pop-up. Okay, great. So now we should see our balance in MetaMask. To use the Hashi bridge and make transactions within Pokeswap, you'll need some ETH as well as some Zor. If you do not have these two assets, pause the video and put some in your MetaMask before going any further. Next, go to your Google search browser and type Polkadot JS Apps Plugin. Click on the first link that appears. Click on Download for Chrome or Download for Firefox. Click Add to Chrome or Add to Firefox. Hit the little puzzle piece next to the fox in the upper corner. And we want to see the polka dot extension, so click on the little pin there. Okay, great. Close that. Now click on the polka dot symbol. Understood, let me continue. Okay, next click on the little plus sign. Create new account. Physically write down your mnemonic phrases somewhere, two places ideally. Do not share these with anyone. Next step. Now name your wallet. Now you have to give it a password in addition to the mnemonic phrase. Write that down in your two places as well, and do not share that. Okay, now we have a Polkadot.js extension. Close the Polkadot symbol. Now go to Pokeswap.io. All right, next you want to connect account. Yes, allow the application access. Select the account to work with. Okay, so now you are in Pokeswap. Now you're gonna move some Zor over the Hashi bridge. So click on bridge over on the sidebar. Okay, click the flip button on the bridge interface because you are going from the Ethereum mainnet to the Sora mainnet. Now click choose token, Zor. And we're gonna send one Zor in this example. Hit next. Confirm. One ETH Zor to one Sora Zor. Okay, confirm. So now we wait for it to cross the bridge. It will take some time depending on how congested ETH traffic is at the moment. Just to reiterate, you have to have Zor to use Pokeswap and you have to have ETH to send tokens across the bridge. Transaction confirmed. One down. So it is over the ETH part of the bridge. Now it's crossing the Zor part of the bridge. Okay, conversion complete. Now let's click on account over on the right sidebar. You should see one Zor there. There it is. You are now officially on Pokeswap with one Zor. You are now able to make swaps, create a liquidity pool, claim rewards, and send and receive tokens. Thank you.